Hey, welcome to the Louisiana Swamp Rat Channel. I was just um, watching the markets and doing a, a little internal review of everything. I just wanted to say that the future is bright and crypto is here to stay. Uh, you, you may or may not know this, but I do spend a lot of time researching crypto, especially Akash. Cosmos, but you need to be aware of the whole space. And I've been in this space for a while, and what I see happening now is the same thing that happened in September and October when everything DeFi was crushed like 80%. You know, I gave the example uh, recently about Ave going from $30 to $600. So the more there is turmoil and a severe destruction of all crypto prices the more that happens my reaction is that i'm more bullish i'm bullish as fuck i'm uh, i'm educated and i spend lots of time listening to people that i trust uh, one of those is the crypto lark um, i'm not going to go into it but if you want to follow him he breaks down exactly who's selling who's buying and all of the big American firms that are lying to you and saying that crypto's over, Bitcoin's in the trash, while the same day they're saying that, they're going and spending billions of dollars to buy Bitcoin. Crypto's here to stay. It's going to be adopted more. There's going to be regulations that come in, and those are going to be bullish because what those are going to do are they're going to open the world to trillions and trillions and trillions of dollars. So that's what's coming. Trillions of dollars. We haven't even gotten started with crypto. I had a vision of it. I'm, that's why I'm up. I'm out here at 1230 at night. Maybe you can see the stars. Oh, they've gone. I have some. Anyway, I am, I'm fucking pumped. I'm so pumped because I know what happens after these dumps, after these drive downs, especially these that last for so long like this one. It's been so severe so strong <clears throat> what that means is on the other side of this we're gonna fucking roll like i'm 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 so excited about where we are with crypto a lot of people are in fear but now is the time to get pumped to be confident have faith in your decisions faith in your companies but i just i i'm i've just got this feeling that we're gonna be in good shape I had a vision. I was looking at the charts today, like top 100 and everything. And it just reminded me, you know, two months ago when I was looking at those charts versus September, October, when everything was in the toilet. And then by April, you know, it was flying again. And here, May, June, July, it's been a total shit show. <clears throat> Elio Trades, I think he totally nailed it with these little mini cycles being a few months at a time. There's not these four-year cycles, one-year cycles. Um, I don't really agree with him as far as the bear market stuff or wait and see. I'm, I'm going to go on record and say we're going to go for it after the grayscale deal. So um, that's where I'm coming from is that we're, we're around the corner. I'm not going to pick days or anything. I'm not stupid or arrogant enough to say I can do that. I'm the worst trader you've ever seen. If you if if you gave me money to trade, I would probably lose all of it. I'm a terrible trader, but I know good projects. Um, I do, you may not know this, I don't make it too public, but I do have a, um, a business degree from Louisiana State University in Baton Rouge, and I did um, major in finance, and I was going to be a stockbroker, and um, my counterculture, go against the grain, don't follow the norm um, qualities that I brought into this life uh, kept me out of that. So I do have a, a pretty good understanding of financial markets, traditional markets, finance. And so it does make crypto easier. Crypto has always been really easy for me. Um, I'm not very technologically advanced, that's for sure. And most of the stuff that's happening, there's no way my 
puny brain could could handle it. But I just wanted to say, most importantly, that Habibi, this is for you, buddy. I came out, gave you a little shout. So hope you like it. Hope you like the lights. I uh, I think I'm gonna start filming in glasses every time, but I can actually look at the camera this time with the light on me. It was so bright I couldn't see anything. So anyway, um, just a quick shout out. Just that I'm bullish as fuck. I'm 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 more bullish now than I've ever been. You have to look at all the other factors that are coming together. And those factors are that people are buying, institutions are buying. There's just been this coordinated FUD for months and months. And now it's grayscale. Let's see if there's another one. But I don't think there's, there's not, doesn't matter what I think. Everything I say is just my opinion too. It's just my opinion that I've formed as myself from my experience and my knowledge and what I observe. So that's it, you know, it's just my, um, I, I think I've got a, a very unique t take on things and I'm not going to follow the crowd and I'll be rolling a cosh deep. So anyway, let's see if Bitcoin, when Bitcoin does its thing, it's got the potential to, to race back up and all the alts to just come with it because with all that money, there's money just sitting on the sidelines. So quality alts, Kosh, Cosmos, DVPN, and countless others, you know, Terra, and Matic probably even they're going to roll, and Ada's got their um, smart contracts supposedly coming next month, so I had a, I had a little vision, I had a little vision of the top 100, and it was, it was crazy, I think, I think we're in for a crazy year, Alex Saunders said, it's just, <clears throat> We're building up to a, a real winner. So get your winning consciousness on. I know it's been painful. Let's see when it's over. Talk soon. Have no fear. Fuck fear. Don't buy in.